Locario. What's going on, people? It's your boy, Mr. Locario, the bad boy of the dating game. What's good? So I got an email. I'm going to read this email real quick, and then we're going to get into this, all right? So it says... Hey, how's it going, Mr. Locario? I'm an IT tech guy that is in the Navy, and all my life, I, ha I always had a hard time motivating myself to approach women. Recently, I've been going to the gym a lot and working on my verbal skills at home, but I always seem to think about playing video games instead of hollering at chicks. I decided to give up video games and other distractions that I have in my life and get this part of my life corrected. Uh, my mother keeps telling me that you're too old to be approaching women in public and should only do online dating. So, Mr. Locario, is it too late for me to go out and holler at chicks or should I just settle with online dating? All right. So, <laughs> first of all, uh, don't listen to your mom for relationship advice, okay? Just just don't, all right? Just don't do that. <laughs> but um, it's weird. In, in your email, you said... You've been working on your verbal skills at home. How are you working on your verbal skills at home? You have to actually be out talking to women to work on your verbal skills. You understand? Like, you're not just going to stand in front of a mirror and, you know, talk to yourself. You understand? You need to be able to talk to another person and, and work on your verbal skills. You understand what I'm saying? So you got to get out there. Now, the question that a lot of guys have, and this guy's talking about, is should you go and holler at chicks in the street or you know public or should you try online dating and you know it's funny because you said your mom was saying you're too old to be going out in public and hollering at girls in the street you should stick to online and no this is the thing there's you guys have to do both you understand anything that can increase the amount of women that you can talk to and have access to you do that right so you don't say, okay, I'm going to stay home and, um, you know, just be on the computer because what's going to happen is, is that you're not going to be practicing your verbal skills by staying home and being on the computer, right? Also, you don't want to just be out, you know, in public all day, just trying to holler at girls because that takes up a lot of uh, time and energy where you could have spent some of that time at home or wherever you're at doing what you're doing and then just got online and hollered at some chicks, right? So you want to sort of do both things right and the thing is is that sometimes you're going to get more action in public when you're hollering at chicks and sometimes you're going to get more action online but the thing is is that when you do both and you combine it then you can have you know more things you understand you're not you're not just designating yourself to one thing so what i would say to you guys out there is to do both right now what I notice sometimes is that, you know, online, there's a lot of chicks who are attention whores. There's a lot of chicks who will um, basically ignore your, your messages because they get a whole bunch of messages online. And for some reason, there's a lot of women who have a super big ego online because they get a lot of emails from dudes and they assume that these dudes are like, oh, I'm getting all these emails and all these guys love me because I'm awesome. But, you know, they don't really know that these guys are just trying to fuck them. You understand what I'm saying? But they get a lot of emails and then they they head get gassed up. So it's like sometimes on the online thing, it might be a little bit more difficult to attract those girls in certain situations. But you still can get chicks online. So you don't want to totally rule that out. You understand what I'm saying? And when it comes to approaching women in the street or approaching women in public at or different places, you know, it's good because now when you're in front of the girl, you understand, it's a little bit more easier than if you were just talk trying to talk to a chick online because now you're not um, in a situation where she got all these dudes literally trying to holler at her at once. It's just you and her in front of each other and you're making that thing happen. You understand? But what I'm saying is, is that you want to you know, put yourself in a position to have, you know, yourself hollering at girls in the street, you know, in public, in all these places, and also to be hollering at them online. You understand? It's kind of like somebody saying, hey, you know, um, should I start this business and do this and then have this other business on the side? Yes, if you have both of those businesses and they're doing well, you're going to have more money. You understand? So if you're talking to girls in the street and you're, you're hollering at chicks online, you, you're you going to have more things going, right? Me personally, right, you know, I, I like 
talking to girls in person, like on a, you know, in public or whatever, more than I do online, you understand? But sometimes I get busy where I'm not really out that much, so then I do the online thing. So this is what I'm saying, like there might be times in your life where you're gonna be so busy with work, you probably got two jobs, you're going to school or whatever, and it's probably easier to just get on Tinder, OkCupid, okay, Plenty of Fish, whatever you're doing, and try to, you know, holler at some chicks there. But if you have some time, it's good to go out there and actually go, you know, to parties and in the street and, you know, clubs or bars, wherever you want to go to, to talk to these women. So I, I, I think it's good to do both because you also want to develop your skill in both. Do you understand what I'm saying? So the thing is, is that one is not really better than the other or you're not too old to be hollering at girls in the street. You know, you should be doing as much as you can to increase the, the, the amount of women that you can get. So if there's women available in the street, at, in, pub, in the public, whatever, you go there and, and holler at girls. There's women available online, you holler at them there. You understand? Don't limit yourself. It doesn't make sense to limit yourself when you can really get more things going, when you have more access to more different venues to make things happen. You feel me? So that's pretty much it, guys. Make sure you click the link below and send me a question. Also, if you need help, with your online dating, make sure you join the Bad Boy Membership Program because I have a membership. I have a program called the Easy Way to Date Online for Men. So you can definitely hop on that and check that out. You got to go to BadBoyMembership.com to make that happen, and also get my book How to Have Sex with Two Women in a Day, so that you can, you know, brush up on your skills of approaching women in the street and stuff like that. You feel me? So that's pretty much it. I'm out of here, guys. Remember, the truth is inside you. Peace. I'm gone. All right, now before you click off this video, I need you to do three quick things. First, I need you to click the link below to send me your questions, because if you have any questions, I'll answer them in a video. Two, click the link under that to get my free ebook, The Magnificent 10 Crucial Dating Tips for Men, gives you 10 tips on how to attract beautiful women. And number three, I want you to click the link under that to go to badboymembership.com, where you get 45 through 90 minute audio and video tutorials every month month. Hey, what's up? It's dating and life coach Mr. Locario. Go to badboymembership.com and master the dating game by joining my Bad Boy Membership Program. In this program, you'll receive 45 through 90 minute, easy to follow, step-by-step -step dating advice tutorials that's guaranteed to help you attract, date, and have sex with beautiful women. Join the Bad Boy Membership today by going to badboymembership.com. That's badboymembership.com.